Well, good morning, everybody. It's me, Mr. Santee, who's feeling like uh, Mr. El Cajon right now. Oh, oh run down. Oh, a little, oh. Run down. Just a, little, <laughs> a little tired. It's, you know, I'm just not a morning person doing these early in the morning. It's just, just not me, but we're doing it. We're here for you because we want you to be Fit Santee. And who are you? I'm Mr. Santee, Rob McNellis, and this is... Big Bad John Minto. Here at G.I. Joe Fitness, G.I. Joe Personal Training, just G.I. Joe. You know Joe. If you don't know Joe, let's introduce him right now. Joe, come on in here, brother. Come on in, Joe. How's it going? It's going all right, I think. It's going all right. Um, so you've got some uh, eight other exercise for us today. Yes. We're just going to pump out, just do one exercise, pump out three different versions of it, right? That's correct. And because I did it last week, you beat me up last week, mm -hmm. I think it's time for Big Bad John to give really? it a little shot. I think so. I think he's feeling a little more energetic than I am this morning, so... I can handle it. He can handle it. All right, so be my place. let's see what you guys got. It right. hurt, but I can do it. All right, let's get started. We're going to do shoulders like Rob indicated. We're going to do three exercises. First, we're going to do with a straight bar, fitness band, and last but not least, we'll do it with the dumbbell. So let's, let's get forward. Let's get moving. All right. So he's getting the straight bar. Now, this is seated. That's correct. This is seated. Now, what's the difference? Why, why seated versus just standing up? I mean, is there, is there a difference? Is yes, it it's a, very, it's a difference because when you're standing... As the weight gets heavier, you tend to cheat and push with other muscles. Okay. But when you seat it, like John, you're, you're completely stabilized. Yeah. So you can only use your shoulders. Is All right, this, let's get busy. Is this better for my back, too? Yes. Now, you, where should I put my hands? About shoulder width apart or where? Shoulder width apart. It's going to okay. put it up for me. We're going to go here, push up, back down. Right up. to a 90. That's it. Never more than a 90? Never more. All right. Maybe two more of those. All right. I'll take You're supposed to problem. breathe, John. Breathe. I am breathing. I'm just not making a lot of noise like you. Because he gives you lightweight. And he's not throwing things at you like he did with me. Okay, so let's see. Now you got a resistance band. you got to wrap underneath the seat. Uh -huh. Let me dangle this a little bit to show you. Okay. No, I'll be dangling things, especially with those short shorts on. What are you doing, man? Wow. <laughs> yeah, I said it. Yes, I did. I said it out loud. Let's go. Bring it up. One. Back down. Two. Uh huh. Now this three, does help if you do it in front of a mirror or something, so you can see that your that angle your 90 is ninety degree angle. Yeah. You just like to look at yourself. Well, you go, come on. Well, if I let you get me fit, then I won't mind looking at myself so much. <laughs> now, will I, Joe? All right, give me about three more. One. Come on. Two. Uh huh. And hold it up. Three. All right, bring it down slow. Hold up, man. That's two mass family guns, isn't it? <laughs> Let's not go there. Okay. Now you got barbells. Barbells. Barbells or dumbbells? I don't know. Is there a difference? <laughs> well, I don't know. Fits on who's using them, Rob? Yeah, well, that's true. That's, <laughs> why, that's why I'm always a dumbbell. 90 degree angle. angle. Uh-huh. Now, is there a difference between putting them my, with my like my palms outward, my palms inward? Does it make a difference? Actually, it does. And what is that difference? You have your front delts and your rear delts. Right now, we, we're hitting the front. You, like to keep them, let's bring them down here. Rule of thumb, I like to make two L's, come down here and freeze. Two L's, inverted L, mm -hmm. straight line across the middle. Gotcha. Anything below that, okay. you risk injury. All, All right. right. Now, okay, I had another question about that. When you're doing those things now, um, lightweight, heavier weight, less reps, do you have a preference as to what you what is best? You will want to, you will actually want to switch it up. You know, because if you do the same thing week by week, your muscles will get used to it, and it will pretty much be a waste of time. Okay. So if you go heavy one there. week. I'm a, uh, so look at this. Wow. Lean. <laughs> Putting us on our side. I said lean. <laughs> so like I was saying, the first week if you go heavy, heavy, you want to go to where if you try your best, you can only do 10 reps. That's heavy. Okay. A lot of people have that misconception, lightweight. Or consumption. You know, yeah. That's not my phone or anything. That's your phone. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, you can't see it on the camera, so. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So uh, when you're doing um, heavyweight, mm -hmm. excuse me, lightweight, you want to do as many as you can. Four right. sets. Right. You know. Four sets, them. 10, 15, something like that. Failure. And if you have the ability to have all three of these things, if you have a bar, uh, you have dumbbells, and you have a, a, a resistance band, do you want to throw all three in at the same time? Or? You can if you have time. If you have the time. If you have the time. All right. 
Well, ladies and gentlemen, oh, let me get it again. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for uh, watching another week of Get Fit Santee. We hope you take some of these exercises and put them into your workout and do what we want you to do, and that is Get, get Fit, fit Santee. Santee.